nothing but nonstop noise. That's the New Orleans soundtrack at the airport. Until you hear who's set up inside the terminal. Looks like he's lounging in his living room, on a couch, at a desk. A man with a typewriter, writing poetry. I never thought that I would see a poet set up on Concourse B. Whether you're arriving or departing, poetry is the language of New Orleans. We turned our tears into water for that soil. Faster than a team of teenagers late for an overseas flight. We've departed from the hardships. He creates custom poems from his airport soul, post. Lovers new to each other. And delivers them to the travelers who sit down to inspire them. And then what's one thing you do well? Christian you know, Davenport. Like it brings you joy. Is the Louisiana guy who calls himself Cubs. The poet. Cubs because he's curious, like a baby bear. A cub. I like being called Cubs because it keeps my spirit youthful. It keeps me open to all opinions and experiences. Raising daughters to become dreamers. Cubs the my poet becomes loyal. Cubs the my doctor. We are the reason love lives. His poems are prescriptions, medicine for the mind. That is fantastic. Did that cure what ails you? I'm feeling better already, but I'm late for my flight. Tickets to places we've never been. His words of wisdom arrive on time. Typed on a boarding pass. A first class ticket from his head to your heart. How do you focus on your fingers in the middle of this madness? Well, typing on a typewriter is like music. There's a rhythm that keeps me focused and I'm able to tune everything else out. Baggage and carry on. Just like the people passing through the airport, his words been. travel on. Turbulence is truth. Bill Wood, Layovers. WGNO News.